At 17, I went on my first date. I was a teenager like I was and um, went to a very comfortable restaurant that most of people know in Sierra Leone, well, in Freetown as Noreska. And of course, not taking anything too huge, it was just a great time to hang out and have fun and get to know this person and I just ordered something light. I think it was burger and the Fanta and then later popcorn because he insisted I took something extra and went home. After that, we're on the phone. We spoke for some time. He thought I ended the call, but I didn't. And I had him tell his siblings, can you imagine? She went on the date she did not bring any of our friends. She did not order as many things I was thinking. In fact, I still have a lot of money left with me. Like, wow, who is she? Like, where do you get people like this? And I was like, am I supposed to bring friends and family members on my first date? Well, I know people say security reasons. Maybe you don't know the guy well. You can take a friend or two but then in my opinion even if you're going to take a friend or two that bill has to be on you and I'll prefer you even give them the money in advance or reimburse them if they use their money so that it doesn't create this weird situation wherein the waiter comes and be, presents a bill to you and it's like all oh, your friends are waiting for you to pay to avoid any awkwardness so what are first, first dates really? Are you not just going there to get to know the person and to have a conversation, to know where you're taking it, like the next step? Or is just something to just eat? Like, oh, it's free food, it's fine. So I wanna hear from you guys. What do you think? Why was this surprise? Is this something that is so normal that you bring your friends and family on a date, especially friends? <laughs> And the guy has to take care of the bill because for me that's a no-no but i want to hear what you guys have to say cheers <laughs>